You see, when the left nostril, we are breathing through left nostril, somehow the right brain gets activated. It calms us down, actually. <laughs> Well, uh, there one question that any quick stress or anxiety relief measures. You know, I'm a believer of how to prevent it in the first place. I'm a believer of vaccination. Before the problem comes, I must be able to identify that I'm getting into it and I better solve it. Now, the problem, today's problem, especially we are talking about is this coronavirus, how to prevent it. And if I have a successful methodology of preventing me from getting that virus, from preventing my family from getting this virus, and when I deploy successful methods, defensive methods, then I will be lesser at stress. I remain vulnerable in the absence of such security measures that I take, especially mentally. Once I have taken mentally certain, uh, what should I say, resolved approach in preventing this virus, I will be more at peace. How do I prevent myself from getting this? First of all, <clears throat> I, I must isolate myself or quarantine myself. <clears throat> Second, if I go outside, and if I have to go outside, if I must go outside, I better wear a mask. Before putting on the mask, I got to have a few drops of oil put in my nose. I don't know how many of you are familiar with this, but some mustard oil or coconut oil or sesame oil or olive oil drops will suffice. So when you put two, three drops in each nostril, it will help capture those before they settle on the nasal passages. Third thing I recommend that once you come back from your outside trip or visit, this is all about cleaning the nose by pouring warm water from this side and taking it out from this side and then pushing it from this side and taking it out from this side. This cleans the nasal passages. Now why I'm recommending this cleaning nasal passages is very important during these times, especially when we are faced by such a deadly virus. Once the virus is removed, you know, there is no way it is going to get hooked up with those receptors. There is no way that it will go to the lungs because you have already removed it from the nasal passages. So that is one way of protecting ourselves. Another thing that you should do is now and then you know, as the president of Belarusia had suggested, you know, those were, it's not a joke, but I find a lot of wisdom in it. He said, drink vodka, a little bit of vodka, and uh, go have some sauna also. Because this sauna and vodka somehow uh, does some trick on us. Because most medical uh, physicians or healthcare givers, they recommend vaporizing you know, your throat and nose when you have cold. But when you go to a sauna, the whole thing is, you know, you are circulating the whole system with this uh, uh, higher temperatures and the you know, steam is there, which will dislodge any viruses from your throat or nasal passages. So there is, a, some, there is some wisdom behind all these things. And there are some herbs, uh, herbal teas you keep drinking. If you can get Giloy, G-I-L-O-Y, powder or a giloy tea or tulsi tea. You can keep on drinking this every half hour or one hour because they also have some ingredients which uh, competes with virus for what they call uh, ACE2 protein receptors. Now what is what I'm talking about here? When virus gets into your nose, it looks for those receptors with which it hooks up. But certain chemicals or medicine which are there, before the virus hooks up, they hook up. So there is no space left for 
viruses to get hooked on to. So that's the logic behind this uh, antiviral drugs. So I would recommend a few of these techniques I have shared with you. Um, once the stress or anxiety kicks in, I would, I would say it's a bit slightly, I know it is justifiable, but it can be prevented also. I would recommend that when you're so much stressed, breathe deeply about five, six times, and especially after breathing deeply five, six times, you close your right nostril with your right thumb and then inhale and exhale from the left nostril. And have your focus also towards your heart while you're doing this. Do this about five times or 10 times. It will calm you down tremendously to remove your stress in, in a big way. I will also show you certain methodology or you can visit my uh, site and how to get rid of these stresses. I'm not able to showcase uh, all the methods we have been practicing through Heartful this way, but they're all proven techniques. You can try it and see how it can help you and your families and friends. You can download all these things for free. There are no charges under heartfulness practices. So, what do you say, doctor? Yeah, great, great. Uh, what I, are, <laughs> I will do that. I will do that. This idea about left, yes. left nostril. Really. That's right. Very simple. Very good. Okay. There is also a logic behind it. See why we do that? Because if there's a big science behind it. Also, you can. I, I, I don't know if you permit me. You can. Uh, discuss all that, you see, when the left nostril, we are breathing through left nostril, somehow the right brain gets activated. It calms us down, actually. Mm -hmm.